Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and in today's tutorial, it's just going to be a simple video. I'm going to be showing you how to turn a slider vertical. So, I'm just going to call this vertical slider demo. And you'd think it'll be easy, but it, it is, but you just need to, uh, it's not very self explanatory. So, a quick search on Stack Overflow does make it easy, but if you don't understand how it works, then I'll hit, I'm here to uh, show you. So, if you drag a slider in, you can't actually turn it vertical, and you'll see you just can't turn it vertical, like, you can set vertical constraints, but you just can't turn it vertical. So what I'm going to do is turn it vertical through code, and I'm just going to add a few constraints to this slider first, or just add some constraints, uh, and now let's say let's just create an outlet to this slider so we'll name this vertical slider all right so if we run this right now you'll see we'll have our slider but it won't be vertical at all and all right so there we go um, I should probably make the slider a bit bigger. Uh, we'll make this. Wait, actually, let's just remove this constraint, and we will make the uh, twenty-five and twenty-five. All right. Now, if I run this again, we should see it has. Uh, actually, should, now that I think about it, I may as well just add a width constraint so that when we turn it vertical, it will end up just. Uh, it will just turn vertical instead of having some weird constraints. So this is a good size slider and now if we want to turn this vertical all we have to do is write a small line of code. So what we have to do is we have to use the transform function uh, vertical slider dot transform it's not 3D because CG outline transform and we want this to be a rotation angle, so we're just turning it 90 degrees, but it's not 90 degrees, we have to turn it by pi divided by 2. So if I just uh, double dot pi, oh, pi, and then we'll just divide that by 2. And that's actually all we need to turn this vertical. So I'll run the app again, and we have a vertical slider. So yeah, this is our vertical slider. And uh, I think if we turn it the other way around, then we should be able to get um, it to face the other way. But yeah, this is our vertical slider. And comment down below if you want to see any more videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in a future tutorial. Bye.